Hi everyone, let's take a look at the Mighty Bowser set that's coming up uh, on the 1st of October 2022, set number 71411. So it's going to retail for £230. Jeez. For 2,807 pieces, 18 plus. So, yeah, <laughs> first, first of all, it's really expensive. I'm sorry to say that again and again, but it is very expensive. And it's also a set that, frankly, nobody really asked for. It's, it's a surprise. It's, it's a, pretty much... This, the same can be said about um, pretty much all of the Nintendo sets, really, including the, the the question mark box. You know, to this day, I still find it rather perplexing that Lego would release such niche sets. But I guess that's the direction they're going, and I have no question about that. You no, know, I I'm not the CEO of a company who's earning, you know. 18 to 20 percent more revenue every year so it must be doing something right um, but yeah apart from it being expensive I think this is a fantastic set <laughs> honestly if, if this goes for free you'll understand this is absolutely amazing you know if you forget about the price element this is another another marvelous set another marvelous Lego creation too bad there are only five images. There isn't a 360. Uh, the box art looks as nice as it possibly can be. If you look, look at it compared to a human person, well, it really is massive. You can see that, but it's not nearly as massive as to the point that I would say, yeah, go for it, 230 pounds, here we go. No, not really, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I think the price really kills it, but if you like Marvel, sorry, <laughs> Super Mario, um, or if you really have a lot of money to spare, then, then go for it. I, <laughs> I, I cannot recommend this to anyone. I wouldn't recommend it to myself to anyone that I know who likes Lego but is not necessarily a fan of Super Mario, if you're a fan of both, then good for you. But I still don't think this is necessary. It is just a brick build thing. If you like this character, if you like Super Mario, to the point that you're willing to just give away more than £230 because you, you'll be spending money on other Lego sets, let's face it. But if you're on a budget, if you don't have all the money in the world to spend on Lego, on toys, then don't. Seriously, there are, there are much better sets out there that deserve your attention. So, yeah, I mean, I don't have much to say about this. I, I think this is, this is gorgeous. This is frankly gorgeous. I don't think they could have done much better than, than they already have done. So... Well, these printer pieces are not new, but the way this thing looks, it, it, I think it is accurate to at least my perception of this character, the, the, the Bowser, not the mighty Bowser, but the, like Bowser in general as a character. But I, for one, would not spend £230 on something like that. I don't think many LEGO fans should do that. I think if you're a huge fan of the theme of the character and Lego, then, then no one's stopping you. But for the rest of us, I'm sure there are much better ways to spend those money. You know, even donated to charity, donated to some worthy causes would probably be better than having another, another Lego set. No, because there, there are a lot, there are a lot of people in the world who are struggling, and <laughs> if this is not a particularly endearing set to you, then maybe, maybe you can skip it. So, that's it. <laughs> Sorry, it's not as positive. That's it.
as other videos. But no, honestly, I love this set. It's just that I, <laughs> I just don't think this is necessary. That's all. Thank you. Thank you for watching.